Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for August 16th of 2023. Well, it is titled ARP 93, a cosmic embrace. So what do we see here? Well, here we see a number of stars and galaxies in this image. And you can take a look around the outskirts of the image and see a number of stars which have the distinct cross diffraction pattern going through them and a number of different galaxies which are more extended objects and don't have that same cross pattern through the center. Now we're focusing on the two galaxies at the center and you may look see one at first but if you look closely you'll actually see that there are two galaxies present here and you can see the two nuclei relatively close together. These are two interacting galaxies which are cataloged as ARP 93 uh, based on an inter galaxy catalog of peculiar galaxies things that looked unusual and not like ordinary galaxies. Now here we have a detailed image of this set of galaxies 200 million light years away from Earth. And we see that they are in the process of colliding together. And in fact, their cores, the two cores there are about 20,000 light years apart. So while they look very close together on the sky in space, they're still quite a distance. But that is only a fraction of the size of our own galaxy, which is 100,000 light years apart. So by that scale, our galaxy would easily overlap these two cores in the central region. Now we also see tidal streams of material stretching out. We can see how distorted the spiral structure is. And down toward the bottom, we see a very a tidal stream of faint stars going out towards the bottom there. And that is again a result of the interaction between these two galaxies. When their gravitational fields uh, affect one another, they will tear the material apart. So when galaxies collide, the stars never collide together. It's very rare that you'd actually line things up perfectly that two stars could collide. However, the gravitational fields interact and can rip material out from one or the other galaxy and we get these tidal streams. Now in the long run, what eventually will happen is that the two galaxies will likely combine together. Those two cores will merge, forming a single galaxy. And then all of these tidal streams will eventually settle down so that if we could come and look at this in a billion years or so, we may just see an ordinary, ordinary galaxy there. So it would have all settled down, we wouldn't see all of the interactions that we see today. But galaxy collisions are extremely slow by our standards taking hundreds of millions of years to occur and then maybe hundreds of millions more for them to be able to settle down and start to look like just an ordinary galaxy with little sign that they ever had this distorted shape. So our galaxy may have done this in the past and will do this in the future as we are on a collision course with the Andromeda galaxy. And they may look something like this to a very distant astronomer looking back towards our galaxy in billions of years from now. So that was our picture of the day for August 16th of 2023. It was titled ARP 93, A Cosmic Embrace. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be a cosmic zoo. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.